So I know what it was like to be bullied. I know that no one should ever have to be bullied. The feeling of feeling so much pain, feeling so alone, feeling like no one loves you, is just heartbreaking. And I don't feel like anyone should ever have to go through that. ECOT 8th grader Tabitha Clough has been through a lot the past few years. When ECOT TV sat down with Tabitha, we talked with her about experiences she had with bullying at a former school and how it made her feel. The reason why my family chose ECOT is because um, I was bullied pretty much um, towards the end of elementary school and all of middle school. Like, I was being bullied so bad that I just started to hate myself. Some of the types of bullying I was experiencing was, um, it was both verbal and physical. I mean, they would always like make fun of me for the way I dressed, you know, as I said, they would uh, push me down the stairs and into my locker. It was, it was really hard. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna start crying here, so sorry. Um, it was like, it was really hard. I mean, everyone pretty much like was so mean to me and because I felt so alone, I felt like my life didn't matter and like, and it's like, if I was gone, everyone else would be better off because that's how everyone made me feel. And I felt like, um, I felt really like depressed and sad like all the time. And it wasn't so much I was sad because I was being bullied, it was sad because I was still alive. It got to the point where I felt like my parents didn't even care about me anymore. Which, I mean, I, I still can't believe I ever thought that because my parents love me so much and they've always been here for me. With the help of her family, Tabitha is planning a special art show in her community on July 7th to help victims of bullying and depression. She is working with local artists who are contributing their art to be auctioned at the show. This, uh, this art show I'm doing, it's, um, it is a fundraiser. There's um, an organization called To Write Love on Her Arms. It helps people that deal with self-injury, uh, depression, suicide, and um, addiction. Through counseling, her passion for art, and her desire to help others, Tabitha is now in a much better place. The main reason why I feel so much better is because like, I want to go out there and I want to help people. Those people that are being bullied, I want to be able to like explain to them that it's like, you know, you have to stay strong and you have to be positive, you know, and you have to realize that it's like, you know, even though now is a tough time, things will get better. Because me personally, I can't make a difference on my own. I can be the one that starts like, like an army of like people wanting to help. I feel that I went through bullying for a purpose. And I feel like that purpose is to give back.